see that. Yep. It is not a true scandy. There is a, it goes up and then a little pinnacle, just like that. So if you're on this stone, it's on the flat. Yep. It's on the bevel, mm -hmm. it's a little bit. Yep. But it's proportional as it went from the flat to the bevel, you go from the bevel to the, 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 the edge. Now, I'm guessing if we, there's no actual point here where it's going to stop, it's pretty, pretty grippy. So it goes up, there's the flat, and like that. Mm -hmm. I reckon, like an old stone, and then back the other way. Uh, uh, okay. no, no. I'm watching my finger, like that. So what I'm doing is I'm addressing the stone. Okay. Now, I mean, I could go. See I'm, where I've been over the years, yeah? Now once you set that the first time, it's just literally getting like that. And when you come off, so my thumb is already under the level yeah. of the stone and it's flat. So it doesn't matter what I do, I might just miss myself. So literally, have a play with that. You'll need recharging with water now already because it's not full water. You don't hold it as long. So if you dunk it in the water, just a little jiggle jiggle and it'll, the grit comes away from it because it's cheap. So we're just using a cheap black spur brand, one pound stone. So give us some room. Make you do it like that if you want on this, but go flat, fill the flat, fill the bevel. So, flat. And you want to start right where the ricasso ends and the blade starts. So, it, sometimes they've got a big, big area unsharpened. So, once I've you got, actually start right, right so in there. So, once I've got the angle right, would it be this way? Yeah. yeah. So, I've got right up against where the blade starts. Yeah. yeah. Like that, like, and a little bit. Yep. Yeah. And then. Mirror image. Yeah. 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 So this I'll way. Over that. Yeah. Right, this way. Yeah. Give yourself a slight sweep. Yes, okay. it, because is it, is, is it coming down this way then, or that way? This way. The other yeah, under your thumbs underneath. You could have gone a little bit further. Okay. You came. You came out with it earlier. Yeah. You were a little low there, and what happened was you were sort of back wheeling it. Sure. So. You're catching, you're catching more there. Right. See? So when you when you went, you went like that easy, and then you you ended up doing that. Right. It, it's the, be, yeah. It's the wrist keeps that same angle. You turn into a machine. So. Okay. So you, yeah, yeah. If you're holding a wheelie, you're balancing it on the front wheel on the back brake. Yeah. You know, so Is that more, any more water? Yeah. Or, it'll just about last a bit more, but you can charge it. It's hard. Flat. Devil and up a little bit. And again, just so I get it right, it's this way. Well, if you had a longer stone, you'd just go like that, but he's okay. a short hour stone. Yep. So if he was a long stone, you'd go yep. like that, because he, he's long, but he's sure. short. So you've got to try and get all the distance in, okay. in a short space. So you, you, you just go in obliquely out. Yeah, you're too Scott, I don't know if, it, if you've ever if you've ever done this, but something that I've, when I first started, started to learn to sharpen um, was uh, a sharpie. You know, a, a sharpie along that's, along that's good your for going along. If you were doing a scandy, mm. just going across that whole large section of blade that's going to show up the tent. Yeah. At the moment, that thing, you you, you make it black and it'll be gone in the first stroke. Whether yeah. you were right, wrong, or indifferent. Okay. Yeah, that was too low. That one. So again, too low, yeah? Yeah. So, uh, uh, look slightly steeper. Yeah. Because that terminal bevel... I'm really bad at lip reading. I'll be back later. No. Oh, that's right. Absolutely fine. Been a pleasure. Been a pleasure. Fantastic. I'm, I'm just working at the minute, so I'm, if people are getting up and, and, and moving off, I'm not going to have a chance to say bye to them. Oh. It's been a pleasure, buddy. Yeah, Lovely to chat. I've got him on uh, Facebook. That, I'll give you a cheap one. Yes, definitely. Let's yes, see, let's it's see if you're getting anywhere. Right, I'm turning. I'm doing one. Yeah, I'm going I'm, I'm to come over to this. Yeah, but I'm working. That's what uh, I'm doing. Okay, yeah, no, I'm turning no, around quick. Where, where are you working, Craig? Yeah. Right. So, All right, guys. You're nearly there. So if you feel it, you'll get, you'll get in a sharp edge. Okay. But you still need a lot more to go. Sure. So, I'm guessing it'll be something like... See, it's cheap stone, yeah? Yeah.
Well, he's getting there. So this is the, the cheapest option in the world. One pound. Yeah. Okay. James, I've if if you want, I've got one of these stones you could have because I've upgraded. Right. You know. So, when you when you come to this one, mm -hmm. that's got there. You still get an edge on it. Sure. It's exactly the same. Oh, there's a bevel. There's a terminal edge. Nothing wrong with this. And forward and back. And forward and back. Okay. And forward. You are putting, you are literally grinding a new edge. You might find that easy. See how I'm keeping the same angle? Yep. So, I'm grinding a new face. I'm making a burr on this side. Mm -hmm. So I'm flipping it over, holding the thumb, keeping it low under the surface of the, of the stone. I'm evening it up. Sure. It ain't going to be great, but the same amount of sort of time. Right, now what I want to do is, I can use this as a hone or a strop, so I'm going the wrong way, the wrong way. And if you feel that, that's, that's getting there more than it was just now. Right, so there's nothing wrong with going up, 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 and I only want to go one way. Because you know, you know there's going to be a burr, you know you're mashing it in his roll around the wrong way. But you're, knock, you're knocking it off there, and now you're even it up to what it was just now. Yeah. And the whole time you're not going one way, then the other, and one way, then the other. And then. Yeah, it, it's, it's crude, it's crap. If you wash it off and have a go at that way of doing it. So you literally, if you had a file and you were putting an edge on a knife, put it in the vise, and you don't, you don't go one stroke, turn it over in the vise, lock it up, one stroke, turn it over, and you go like that, yeah. and, you, and, you, and you grill it absolutely murder nice and flat, and you turn it over and get it right. Then you've got to tidy it up, and you get to that later. But if you want to have a little play at getting so just, that. If you don't mind, just show me one more time. On, on the, yeah, so, right. So you can see it, I'll come, come like this. Yeah. Right, there's the flat. Yep. There's the bevel. Moors have a, a micro bevel at the edge. So it's up about the same what it was beforehand. Yeah, so e e yeah. Oh. And then I'm, all I'm doing is remove material at a constant angle. I'm not interested on the actual apex of the thing in order to get a nice fit yet. I'm only on like 600 grit. So The other way. Yep. Hey, you know, sushi chef will look at me going. My kids take the noise about sharpening the knife. Yeah. So that's that's creating a burr that way. Not the burr off. No, I'm making a burr the other way. So I mean, you literally now could go. Of wood. Not hard. Yep. I'm not trying to grind a new edge. Now you could get newspaper. You just want to snap the burr off. Yeah. Now that is a reasonable edge. Yeah. Good, 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 good. That's the practice. There will be more to it than that. Yeah. But yeah. That's the practice. No, I'm definitely gonna have a look at it. Yeah. Again, so I think. Right, so that's the crappy one. Mm -hmm. So if you put that back in, I'll show you the the one that's brown and white with a black base. And you can do the nice one afterwards. Right. So you if you dig too deep on that, you'll scrape stone off. Okay. Yeah. Oh well we've messed up the edge of So eventually yep. you know, but they're a pound. This is around about twenty pounds okay. of, of Amazon, but wait till they're on offer. They do come up quite yeah. often different story this is not as crude as that so you dig it in you really ruin it because you, you just expect to lose the flat yeah you want this flat sure that's exactly what you want so we soaked it you literally put some water in your hand and put it on top a second yeah and, right there we go now if there were a case of you you, you could go one way only 
what you're looking for is the slick. Now you've been on the beach where you've got silt and sand and little black lines mm -hmm. where the finest sand has come up through and has rippled and stayed in a certain yep. spot and you've got all that. That's what will happen here. So I can go that way or that way just because I'm showing off, right? And all of a sudden, you should start to get not just black, yep. ever so next to nothing there. That should, that should be the steel. But the grain in the stone, if you looked at it, it was like um, egg boxes. Mm -hmm. You're filling the egg box holes up sure. with this crap. Yep. So you're losing less peak differential between the bottom of the grit. So event, that's why you clear the thing okay. when you go yeah, back yeah, in yeah. the water. So that black, I mean, this should be a lot wetter because it hasn't been soaked for an hour. No, even then, I put it up. <coughs> now we'll get to the sand. This, this, this is the zen moment of, of night shine. If you're into it, I have to sit there all night. And, you know, there's men all over one. Get the mic closer, please. All right. So, see how I'm setting in that? Eight? Set them in that eight? Yeah, I'll mess that one up then. I ended up going too low. That was better. Right. From before, 20 times more expensive. Now feel that edge for the same amount of work. World's different, right? So if you recharge that, have a play with him. You put it back in the water? Yes, yeah. you. Now that is to clear the steel from the egg box bottoms and there will be attrition on that as well and you're trying to clear it. A bit like if you had an angle grinder, um, a stone grinder on the wheels, every now and again those pits will glaze over because you've flattened all the mountain peaks off. Yeah. So you put a, a, this evil thing, it's called a stone dresser, it's like a convoluted arbor type wheel thing, it was crap, I, know, I hate wheels, and you, what you do is redress the stone, so you flatten it up and clear all the, all the stuff that's filled all the valleys in to get the bike back. Yeah, yeah, sure. Right, so have a play with that, now you need to be going, that's it, that way, up, fill, up again, and you, you can push harder on this, I want to hear. You're on the verge, again, wheeling. You're bouncing on the back brake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you go too far that way, the blade will dig into the stone. Okay. It damages the stone. Don't worry about it, all right? But that, that's when you're doing something that's counterproductive and you're going to be destroying the edge of the knife. Yeah. So you, you, you're, you're wheeling on the back brake. And you want to find it, set it, and you, everything in here is now a machine. Yeah. <laughs> it just takes a knack. Yeah. Jeez. Harder. Harder. More pressure. More. Better. You're removing steel on a stone. Yeah. Alright? <laughs> it's not using it on a belt, on a, on a thing where it, a light touch, because you don't want to burn it. If it's cool, you're not going to burn the edge. Sure. Yeah. Was, that, was, was that getting better? Yeah, yeah. yeah, and then coming back the other way. So this it's all muscle memory, riding the bike and all the rest of it. So you ain't... That was low. You, was were, too on, low, you yeah. were on the flat bevel. That's a bit better. A little bit less. A little bit more. Somewhere like that. Yeah, I'm guessing the muscle memory must... Everything. Yeah. I mean, I, I, get, I get a pencil at school, and I say, right, I want a 13mm border on the outside of that piece of wood, and I go... Yeah. <laughs> That finger sets the thing, sets the pen. Vroom, 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 vroom. Yeah. Measure it. Tell you what, 68. Vroom. You get a running rate, 67.2. It's just, my, my eyes, I got I got that. It's like Terminator, yeah. right? But the rest of it is, I, yeah, I can see you, but I, I can see one eye, now the other. Literally, that's how, I don't know why, why it is the way it is, but that, that's me. It's muscle memory. Everything's muscle memory. Too low. Too low again. Didn't sound right. And, and don't get cocky. That was quick for someone who lamped on it. Too quick, yeah. Because you'll cut yourself here.